Welcome to Tech Corner, brought to you by 1-800-Endoscope.com. Today we are going to explore the world of USB scopes from 1-800-Endoscope.com and show you that USB is as easy as 1, 2, 3. The 1-800 USB series of scopes are designed for ease of use, dependability, and affordability. This makes them a perfect choice for many industrial and veterinary applications. These scopes come in two standard sizes, 36 inch and 60 inch. Its standard equipped inspection tube is obedient and will hold its shape so you can get into those tough to reach places. No more wrestling with a wet noodle like the tubes you find on other manufacturers flexible bore scopes. The 1-800 USB scopes also have long life LED lamps providing over 100,000 hours of use. Also equipped with micro camera technology with resolution of 400,000 pixels. Light calibration and video control buttons on the control body for taking pictures and video via your laptop or desktop PC. First, let's talk about what a USB scope is. It sounds high tech, but really is a very simple. Don't let USB portion of the name scare you. USB simply stands for Universal Serial Bus. Now this is just a fancy name for that little place in your computer that you plug in items like your keyboard, mouse, and other peripherals. Before we get ahead of ourselves, let's install the software first. The manufacturer recommends that you not plug in your scope during software installation. And also, just as a reminder, never plug in or unplug your scope while the software is running. Today we are using a laptop running on Windows XP platform. The scope is also compatible with Windows Vista and the scope comes with software to install either platform. As we mentioned before, this scope can be used for veterinary use, especially equine. You may be asking yourself, isn't that stiff tube a little tough on the horse? The answer is yes. The 1800 Endoscope also offers a USB scope for veterinary use. In that model, they replace the obedient industrial type tube with a Class 6 medical grade flexible tube and add two-way angulation. That opens up a whole new arena for treadmill and track testing. The scope can be inserted into the nasal cavity of a horse and can be connected to a PC either on a backpack of a jockey or any other sort of saddlebag. Not only can you record during the entire test time, you can also use the scope as a webcam. This means you can view real-time video of the testing anywhere they have internet connection. This product was built to, to work with MSN Messenger Live and it works great. Now we will show you how easy it is to install the software. Before we get to the installation of the software, we want to show you footage taken with the 1-800 USB video bore scope. See how you can easily make out numbers on the intake manifold here. The small 9mm OD allows you to get into those tough to reach, much less see areas. This will significantly reduce teardown times and make for easy diagnostic. As we move around the engine compartment, notice the detail that you can make out. Remember, you can take still pictures or record the entire diagnostic as a video to be played back later. Now back to the installation. Your 1-800 series USB scope will come equipped with both Vista and XP software. For our demonstration, we're going to be using XP. Put the installation disk into your disk drive. Navigate Navigate to the drive for where the disk is. And double click on the installation icon. Then follow all on screen prompts. Remember, our scope is not connected at this time. Yeah. 
when the software is finished installing. Connect one end of your USB cord to your scope and the other to a USB port on your PC. If this is the first time you've installed the software and connected your scope, you'll get a small balloon indicating that you, it's ready to run. We've ran it before. Now you should just find the icon that was installed by the software, double click it. Now you've got your software running and, hey, who's that guy? That's right, it's a tech guy. And if you want this to go full screen, it can do that. Back to the show. Now that the software is installed, let's connect our scope. Simply connect the small end of the USB cable into the port on the scope's control body. Then connect the larger end to the USB port on your PC. You will know that you have connected it properly when the light on your scope comes on. Remember, we do not have our software running yet. After you have connected your scope for the first time, wait for the small information balloon on the lower right hand corner of your screen. It comes up and tells you that the drivers have been installed and your program is ready to use. You will only have to wait for this the first time you use your scope. Our software is loaded, our scope is hooked up, what now? I'll tell you, use it. A little practice goes a long way when it comes to this kind of tool. Let's familiarize ourselves with the controls. At the top of the control body is the light calibration knob. This controls our light output from full on to full off. The two triggers here control our on-screen video. The first trigger takes pictures and the second trigger takes video. Hold down either one of these triggers for about two seconds and depending on the one you press you either take a picture or begin taking video. Press again and video recording will stop. Well that's it for this installment of Tech Time brought to you by 1-800-Endoscope.com Until next time, thanks for watching.